Hey guys, this looks like a fun one. It says evaluate. It's negative two times the quantity negative two squared plus two to the negative two whole quantity to the negative two. This is day 16 of our algebraic February calendar. For the month of February, we're gonna solve 28 algebraic problems. There are some pretty cool looking ones on here. And if you wanna try this one, pause it right now because I'm gonna solve it in three, two, one. First, let's focus on this term in the parentheses. Negative two squared means the same thing as negative two squared. You end up doing the exponent before you apply the negative. Inside the parentheses, two squared is equal to four. So the first term is negative four. And then for this term, two to the negative two, a negative exponent puts this in the denominator. Two to the negative two is the same thing as one over two squared. Here are the notes for that. A to the negative B is equal to one over A to the B. So two to the negative two is equal to one over two to the two. And two to the two or two squared is equal to four. And now we've simplified every term inside the parentheses. Let's smush them together and copy down everything else. In order to combine these two terms in the parentheses, we have to give them a common denominator. We can rewrite this negative four as negative 16 fourths. That way it'll have a common denominator with the one fourth. Negative 16 fourths plus one fourth is negative 15 fourths. This negative two exponent, we can break it apart into negative one times two. And then using these notes, anytime you have a to the power of b times c, you can rewrite that as a to the b whole thing to the c. So we can take this negative one and put it on the inside of the parentheses. And then a negative exponent ends up flipping your fraction. Here are the notes right here. a over b to the negative one is equal to b over a. So this negative 15 over four to the negative one would be negative four over 15. This is the same thing as this. But now we have negative four over 15 in the parentheses. This squared means the same thing as this multiplied by itself. And when you're multiplying fractions, you can make them a single fraction and multiply across. Negative four times negative four is positive 16, and 15 times 15 is positive 225. Now we need to multiply this 16 over 225 times negative two. And negative two times 16 is negative 32. And this is the answer to our question. Let's put a box around it. How exciting. This fully simplifies to this. And here's tomorrow's question. It says solve for x, and we're given the quantity x squared minus 6x plus 10, whole thing to the power of the quantity x squared minus 8x plus 16 is equal to one. This looks like a fun one. How exciting.